Ladies and gentlemen, tonight it is my pleasure to introduce to you in the tradition of songwriting partners from Lennon to McCartney, from um, Jagger to, we've got Cameron and Tanner, Spondiferous. These guys have been around for about a year. You know them all. You know them like we all know them. And I, I've got to hear them play quite a bit. And I'm impressed. They're young guys. Um, and you can tell that they're committed to each other. And you can hear it in their playing and in their songwriting. So it's fun there for us, ladies and gentlemen. We also get a round of applause for a church curtain tree for us.
any minute now. The song's called Irene. Yeah. 
Thank you guys again. So uh, Cameron and I, a little while back, actually wound up writing a song each for the same girl. And so... <laughs> and neither of us got her. What a heartbreaker. <laughs> she was the utmost heartbreaker. But we got two of our favorite songs out of it, so fair trade. <laughs> this one's called Sister. The irony is not lost on us. Sister, don't leave me, don't let me go Sister, I'm tired 
So we have a fairly short show tonight. It's, it's, uh, we only have 11 songs prepared, but we're hoping that each one can pack some sort of a punch. <laughs> Again, uh, what is that, the third time I was gonna say it? Thank you all for showing up. I'm really thankful. <laughs> Just so much gratitude to go around. This next song here is uh, proudly called Bubbles. It's a weird one, prepare yourselves. Despite how it is 
chance to see someone I'm just going to give you some backing music. Um, I want to start with I want to start with Mark over here on the left side. You've always been like family. You've been very open. Love you, Mark. You've been there. This is one of the most genuine people I've ever met in my life. And um, I think it, it's some weeks when we were having a hard time in in Salida, just leaving home for the first time. Mark was, was there to talk, and it was, it was always good. So thank you, Mark. You're a genuine and kind human being. He also does great music. Another person, real quick, I'd like to um, thank isn't here today, which is because he just, there, there was something scheduled when we scheduled this, but Jeff Bamberg, we built these guitars at his shop, and he has also been very open and kind, letting us use his shop. And, stay there and do all this stuff, which has been really, really, really helpful. So, wherever you are right now, Jeff, thank you. This next song is called Silhouettes. Silhouettes that I've dreamed Were shouting my dreams in a moment or two 
But every imperfection in me is dragging me down and they play me the fool, but I'm not chasing fairy tales. in high places and pitfalls holding out for a better song until it comes I never quite found what to play to play my thoughts and to keep me sane Cause even if I wrote it down a better line is coming around and and pitfalls holding out for a better song until it comes I've been gone to hide from my mind I've been lost nearly all my life I'm alone, but for now I think that's fine I just hope I never lose my sight to music, which I don't know why we wrote it, but in terms of our relationship to people, I don't know what inspired us to do that, but we were thinking, what if music was a person and we could write a song kind of from the perspective of being a friend of that person, and uh, it's like music is, it's a terrible explanation, <laughs> music is the person of that song. These are both the new guitars we built at the guitar shop. Tell us more. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, we spent the past several months over at the guitar shop, uh, Rocky Mountain Guitar Co. down on First Street, and wound up doing sort of a barter system with Jeff, the owner, where we filmed him doing an entire online course, um, teaching others how to build their own guitar. And in return, he showed us how to build ours. And so what you see before you is the work of our own hands. It caused many, pa many painful nights and crying and thinking that we'd uh, messed them up several times. Uh, I had not so much as touched a saw or a sander or any of that. Before this trip. But so that was fun. Yeah, this is, this is something that's really exciting to keep with us. So over the last year, I've had, four, I've had conversations with four different individuals that say they struggle with depression or um, suicide. And so this is a song that I wrote based on that. And uh, it's, it's called The Suicide Song. So. Aptly titled. All right. I love you, brother. You're just laughing at all of my <laughs> awkwardness up here. <laughs> 
Thank you, everyone that, that came and has no idea what's going on and doesn't know me that well. But I hope y'all enjoy. <laughs> yes, he is always this awkward.
Okay, a couple of people that I actually have to thank that I want to make sure to thank. We have to thank Kurt and Shree because they have let us spend a lot of time here. And um, we've been living in our car the last year and we tried to make it a full year in our car, which was hard from winter to winter. And Kurt and Shree gave us a warm place and all the kindness in the world. So I am very grateful to you guys. Um, uh, another person I'd like to, to thank is Tony and Maggie from Trax. You guys were incredibly nice to me. It was, it was awesome being, they were, they were my boss for a couple uh, months, so more like six months. <laughs> so yeah, you guys rock, thank you very much. I don't know if there's another office with people as kind as, as your whole team, so y'all run a great ship there, so thank you. <laughs> this next song is called Hello Brother. And it's kind of written based on how I feel about people in general. Uh, I think that people I meet in life are kind of like my brothers and sisters as I get to know them. And I wrote this kind of just as my thoughts of what I would like for my brothers and what I would like for my sisters in life. So I hope you enjoy it. Since the guitars are new, the wood's still setting in. Oh, yeah. A little bit of grace here. <laughs> Sister, where are you going? 
let one give back We'll find us eventually On our way And maybe we always will be Everybody's working It's all about how we see things so new it's like mid song it just wants to shift on you so speaking of people who thank we have yet another person because life is just made up of relationships and people that contribute to you and you hopefully get to give back a little bit um, Stacy and Kevin right here in the front have been instrumental for us this year in teaching us about uh, living on our own and life spirituality and uh, you know just everything business that there is and so uh, a while back I was having a conversation with them and uh, basically we were in this kind of place where we we're like how do we pay you back and the words you s said were to take what we learn and to pass it on um, and so that's where that line and that song comes from and that last song as one gives let one give back that whole section's about you guys. So thank you for all the mentoring that you've done. You've honestly changed our lives. So this is called Walk With You. Try to change 
face to face So you can be with me We'll see each other soon But if I try to change it all Please don't change it all And I'll keep chasing you Tempos are fun.
As I said, this was a fairly short show. We had 11 songs prepped, so this will be the last song. This is song number 11. I specifically wrote this song at the end of last year as we moved to Colorado. Um, it was a song about saying goodbye, and so with this song, we say goodbye to Salida. Man, we're gonna see all y'all again in the future. Come on. Not goodbye forever. Put your dreams away from now. Oh, wow. Look at me go. I sang the wrong line. <laughs> first two. We're going to try that one more time. What's the first line? Before I... No. Morning. Morning. There we go. We figured it out. We got there eventually. Now to 
anyone who's sticking around for another little while, because we know we didn't go till nine, I'd love to visit and get to talk to everybody. So thank you all for coming, though. This was really fun to do. And we've been waiting for a while. And one more round of applause for Curtin Tree at a church for putting this on. Thank you, guys. All right. I was so nervous. Dude, ASMR <laughs> going like the whole time, man. Oh, man. Tingling all over. That was amazing. I like bubbles. Bubbles are the best. Bubbles? You yeah, like bubbles? Yeah, yeah. Oh, all that music. I started out with young parts. I started out with young parts. Yeah, man. I love it, man. Yeah. 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 Ye